everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to Gushmala hunting and right now I am currently inside of Target, inside their plush section. A few days ago I went into their website and I saw that they released a lot of new squishmallows. So I entered the page, clicked on the squishmallow that looked exciting. I checked the location and I heard that this location that I'm at had some specific characters in stock. So I went to the store and you guys, they have a lot of new squishmallows to check out and I can't wait so let's go see what we can find oh my gosh they have tons of squishmallows today it's been a minute since I seen a target this stocked and it's super exciting to see that they got a new squad because I feel like every time they release more they just get more exciting and it looks like they have different sizes as well I always like seeing the variety and it also appears that there's new squishville sets there's just squish everywhere let's check them out a new Squishmallow I'm seeing so far is Mitch the Platypus. She reminds me of Brindle from Five Below, except this one has a new pattern which includes blue, pink, and purple. She also has a fuzzy belly similar to Brindle, and her colors are really pretty. I love this shade of blue. I haven't seen it on a Squishmallow, and I think it just makes this Squishmallow look overall calm and really adorable. Another Squishmallow I'm seeing is what appears to be a bowl of ramen. Let me just say, the detail is amazing. I love the chili, how it's 3D, not just printed. I think that's just amazing. And I feel like Kelly Toys has been stepping it up with some of their new Squishmallows. It has the chopsticks and the food in there with like some seasoning. She has eyelashes, rosy pink cheeks, and she has this interesting pattern on the bowl. Let's see her name. The name is Odeon. On the top shelf, they have more Squishmallows and these appear to be 11 inches. They have a red dinosaur named Dolan and he has a spot design and it's cool to see another dinosaur. He has some dark blue spikes and you can see his tail. It has the simple face with a smile and a white tummy. They have another Highland cow and this one reminds me of Calton. The name is Shep and this one has a lot of interesting colors and features going around for example on a nose it has like i honestly forgot the term but it has this gold embroidered detail right there and then it has a gray mane which is really fuzzy and it also has a fuzzy belly which i love and again with the neutrials those are some of my favorite squishmallows it has some horns the little ears and oh you guys it even has a little cute tail this one feels super soft what an interesting cow squishmallow I spotted two more Squishmallows in this size. The first one is the snow cone, which is named Beaven. I've actually seen it online, but in person, I think it looks a lot fun. And it's really interesting because it has the shepherd pattern and it feels really fuzzy. And I feel like Kelly Toys did a great job with blending it in. It has eyelashes, rosy pink cheeks, and a cute red smile. I usually don't see dessert or ice cream squishmallow so this is really interesting and the name is as well that's the little description is that a well you guys oh my goodness yes i believe this is a well and the name is danica it has a blue tie-dye pattern which reminds me of the ocean and i feel like it is very suitable for this creature here i'm just loving the simple facial expressions it has a fin as well as a tail and you guys guess what i saw i looked at the price tag and it says blue crinkle dolphin but it's funny seeing it all together because it, it looks super interesting i'm so excited excited to share the new 16 inches that they have they have like three characters so i'm just get them and show you guys in detail they're really exciting okay the first 16 inch that they have is this woolly mammoth except the color is orange it is really bright bright vibrant and you can see all the colors going on it has a cream colored fuzzy belly and you can see the long the horns and then you can see the little trunk it's tie-dye pattern in the ears and it is really soft bright orange mane it also has a cute little tail honestly the stuffing is just great like it feels really soft and squishy and this one's name is wilby 
Next up, they have a stack of pancakes, and this one is probably one of my favorites out of Target's new drop. I love all the details and how amazing the quality is. On the top, it has whipped cream, but you can see it's actually 3D. And same with the strawberry, it is a bright red color, and with felt, it has the little leaves. It's honestly super cool that they did that, not just the printed fabric. And one of my favorite features is that it has pink syrup you guys like i love the color pink and i think that just added a really nice touch to it speaking of the pink right here on the layers it has a really light shade of pink i think this one looks really nice with the aesthetic the name is sautel so we have sautel the pancake stack they also have a lavender colored walrus with the name of kwami this one is really funny because at the top it has like little hair. It's like a gray color and this one is just super cool. The gray matches right here on its tummy. You can see it has whiskers and it also has flippers which is my favorite part. And along with that it has these fins. They also have this creature. I'm not sure what the correct term is but it looks like it'd be a sea creature or a wildlife animal. The name is Banks, as you can see, and it has a really pretty mint color going all around. It has a fuzzy tail, which reminds me of ferrets. Maybe that's what it's supposed to be. I'm not sure, but it has a really bushy tail that's another shade of blue. Tie-dye pattern on the belly. It reminds me of Xavier the Mushroom. It has the same pattern right here on the eyes. It has a cute little nose. This is the tag. It also has some really adorable ears. <laughs> they have Malcolm the Mushroom. Oh my goodness. I don't think I've ever seen Malcolm in a big 16 inch size he's really cool because this tag says special edition so you can see the holographic shine look the top instead of spots it has flowers you guys <gasps> it has like these little daisies and it just matches very nicely with its belly the website was right it said that there was like three left so it was correct look at how satisfying it is to see this box like almost full you can see all the little sets of five inch cuties and they have the mushrooms they have the set with the five inch mushrooms this one is molly and we have molly over here to the right this is molly's tag and i really like this one because she's pink and she also has hearts to match she is winking and she also has little rosy cheeks and bordered and then molly here is a blue version of molly and he also has the same pattern on the top he has a really pretty teal color they both have white bellies and this is the back this would be a great gift for valentine's day next to those they have the insect set they have this one which is named hadian the tag is a little bit stuck but you can see the name is hadian and i'm not sure what this one's name is it's like a version of rutabaga her name is Luxi. Hadian here has some heart designs at the top of the antenna, some wings, and a pink belly. And then this one has a lot of colors and a cute little pointy tail. The last two in this box is the dog set and the ones with the dragons, which we've seen before. XOXO. And then the cute, adorable dogs. We have the tan one and the pink one. Which one is your favorite set of this series? We also saw these on one of our adventures, but I saw a new design. This one is a rose and it has the embroidered design at the top. This one is super cool and fuzzy. The brand is Bum Bums. When you open the tag, you can see the full collection. So you can see the ones that they have. And I'm not sure if we saw this one last time, but it's a cute little shrimp. And it has these little heart antenna. Little cupcake. And another one. They have three 16 inches today, the dragon, the pug, and the ice cream. Working our way up here, you can see that they have two hug me's, the dog and the unicorn. This one's name is Esmeralda, and then this one is Duffy. They also have these pillows that say the messages. They're scattered everywhere. And they also have the box of the Disney Squad. I just found a Krabby Patty Valentine's Day box. I'm not sure if this would have chocolate or the little gummies with 
the toppings but i've never seen this in stores i'm not sure where this originally came from i'm not seeing it on the shelf but it's a really neat idea and i love the velvet fabric right here you can see spongebob's funny face i also spotted the crazy Aaron's thinking putty i saw these last year but i'm glad they brought them back it has these little messages for Valentine's Day and right here it gives you an example of one of the ones you can find. Here is the container. It has these little add-ons inside and it's a clear putty base. I am now in the toy section of Marshalls and I found some Easter Squishmallows. I checked both of the squads and for this one I saw Candace the cow and for this big 12 inch it has an assortment of Easter Squishmallows. I've seen online that people have been finding the original Balana, maybe TJ Maxx will carry her but I did find a pink bunny named Bop. She has multicolored fuzzy ears and some eyelashes. I also love her little nose because they gave her a coral color and then I found some 12 inches. They they have a gnome named Maddox. He has some Easter ears, a fuzzy beard, and this is the squad. I love all his colors because they're really pastel. A multicolored bunny named Dania. She has like all the colors of the rainbow blended in. These are $11.99 and same squad. Hi guys, I'm now at Ralph's and as I entered the store, I noticed they had boxes of their Valentine's Day Squishmallows. These are 12 inches and you can see that they have lots of boxes. So I'm assuming they're about to restock on them. Quick view of all of them and you guys, they also have cows they have evangelica these are the ones that have inspiring messages this one says dream big and you can see it's the evangelica with the iridescent sparkles this is the tag they have two and i believe there's more scattered in the bins but these are the ones that are visible chappy the mushroom i remember seeing this one at food for less let's see Ooh, this one's this one's a big one. It says hugs and squishes, and I spot a pig. This one is rosy. Her belly says sweet. They have a teal cat, and this one says sweet as well. Coming to another bin, they have a corgi. I love you. A pink eagle that says text me. The name is Kamala. They have the sugar glider cutie. Let's see. The name is Rayan. And that's not it, you guys. They have even more. So here's how the area looks. Over here, they have this lavender colored fox. And the name is Lamora. Okay, this one says forever. The name is Paloma. <gasps> Ooh, they have a purple octopus. And this one is Buella. I'm in their main seasonal section and they have another box. This is amazing, you guys. And they have this axolotl, which the name is Lomo. Even more of the characters. <gasps> they have a lot here. The chinchilla, which is named Camilo. They have Della the duck, really pretty. They have a teal cat with a heart. The name is Corinna. They have a unicorn, Molly, Babs the Blue Jay with the embroidered letter. They have a cute little dog with the letter E. And, oh, we did not see this one, you guys. It's a blue mushroom. And his name, I'm assuming it's Molly. Yeah, it's Molly. And he has a letter on his little stomach. This one's actually super cute in an 8 inch. They have the dragon, the hippo. I think this is another one we haven't seen. It's a blue squirrel with a bushy tail. I'm curious, what is the name? Santiago. Cute. They even have the massive bin with the 20 inch squishmallows. Monica the axolotl, Adi the pink shark, Tear the narwhal, and massive chunky Colin the cow. I also found a 16 inch squishmallow. This is an avocado named Mariah. That is the tag. And this is the inside. I really like seeing the illustrations. She has a fuzzy pit similar to Austin and her cheeks are in the shape of a heart and they're bordered which i find very neat she has eyelashes a red smile and on the bottom it says xoxo she's really big and really squishy as well they also have a tie-dye cat named eloise she has a sparkly bow and her belly says xoxo you guys also found some nerds gummy clusters in their valentine's section where they have candy 
by the exit they had squishmallows of all sizes what's interesting about this location is that whenever they get squishmallows they always set them up so when it was halloween i remember they had them stacked up on a tower and it's just overall really fun to see what they do next i also saw a dog stuffed animal all right everyone we're back from our squishmallow hunt and now it is hot time so can you guys believe that my mom actually bought a squishmallow we were just at ralph's and a specific squishmallow caught my mom's eye and she actually ended up getting it it's evangelica did you guys guess correctly she loves the cows and you know we've been trying to find evangelica so she decided to get it that's the tag and look it has a little tail actually really cute and soft so we got that one and i ended up getting some lifesavers because these are also another one of my favorite like candies and my favorite flavor is probably the watermelon one and from target i also ended up getting these little candies it's cherry and strawberry banana gummies you can see the tag <laughs> and it comes with like a little mixture of these heart sugar coated candies I want to give a shout out to one of my subscribers because she commented that I should check out Ralph's because you know they've been getting lots of squishmallows and I want to thank her because as you guys saw they did have lots of squishmallows so that was a great suggestion thank you so so much alright everyone that is gonna wrap up this week's adventure if you guys enjoyed the finds today don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below thank you so much for watching and I hope I'll see you on the next one bye everyone